Welcome to the Tuesday, January 6, 2015 edition of Erner Berry's Market Video, sponsored by the Meat Buyer's Guide Online. In today's video, Blue Star Foods acquires Sigma International. Then later, the new year starts off with record high brisket prices. But first, the USDA's dietary guidelines for Americans stands to change a good deal in 2015. Here with that story is your host, Jamie Chadwick. 2015 is now underway and it is officially time for a new edition of the U.S. Department of Agriculture's report, Dietary Guidelines for Americans. Updated every five years, the guideline provides recommendations for better overall health, including information on food intake, exercise, and reducing the risk of chronic disease. The dietary guidelines stand to change a good deal in 2015 as a panel advising the process is pushing to include new environmental considerations. By bringing the topic of environmental sustainability to the discussion, the panel is pushing to drastically change the impact of the dietary guidelines. The North American Meat Institute, in comments submitted, raised strong objections to the 2015 Dietary Guidelines Advisory Committee's removal of lean meat from a healthy dietary pattern, stating the actions were made in haste and are not rooted in science. For more on this and other news from the center of the plate, head over to foodmarket.com. Next up, SeafoodNews.com staff writer Michael Ramsing reports on the acquisition of Sigma International by Blue Star Foods. John Keeler and Company, which operates as Blue Star Foods and is a leading blue swimming crab meat importer based in Miami, has expanded its crab operations with the acquisition of Sigma International. The deal was effective January 1st, with all of Sigma's employees retained under the contract and will continue to operate out of its headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida. Financial details of the acquisition were not released, though it was confirmed that a majority of Sigma supply contracts had successfully been transferred. No interruptions are expected to impact the company's day-to-day -day operations. Blue Star C CEO John Keeler said his company will take advantage of Sigma's unique position as a major importer and distributor of Chinese red swimming crab meat, which the executive said he will use to build up Blue Star as a premier importer and distributor of the product throughout the U.S. market. For more on the deal between Blue Star and Sigma, along with other seafood industry company news and notes, head over to the Co Seafood tab in Comtel. Thanks, Michael. To finish up today's video, Beef Market reporter Gary Morrison looks at record high brisket prices as 2015 gets underway. Brisket prices for 2014 outperformed all previous ones on record. There were a few main factors, but instead of rehashing them, you can read the story from April 2014 by searching Spotlight on Comtel. As the calendar turns to January of the new year, buyers of briskets are looking forward to St. Patrick's Day and planned celebrations with corned beef and cabbage. This means they need to start focus on building inventories. If buyers of briskets look at prices to start 2015, they will notice that they are at record highs. What is this going to do to the mindset of those buyers? Will fear build upon itself as buyers just look to procure a product at any price? Or will buyers be scared off and look to something non-traditional for this festification? The answer to these questions will go a long way to shape how the price line looks into this year. Thanks Gary, that concludes today's video. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Today's video is sponsored by the NAMP Meat Buyer's Guide Online, an interactive way for you to learn and understand more about the items you buy and sell. The NAMP Meat Buyer's Guide Online features high-definition videos for all of your major red meat items. Head to meatbuyersguide.com to view a demo and sign up today.